It's starting to get hot, but feel it, feel the humidity coming on. And look, the wind stopped blowing too. You know what that means? It's gonna be hot today, bro. How long have you been standing on those thorns? How many days? Three days. Three days, bud. Keep sanding, you're doing a beautiful job. So now what I'm gonna do is I got my hammer and my dolly. Now you need a dolly that's gonna fit up inside there. And from taking the skin off, it had warped the edges of our body here, see? So what I'm gonna do I'm gonna get that all back in shape. Several dollies. So, this is my favorite one. What's up? You have two current dogs. That's the doll and the dolls you pull behind and pitch them on there. Back here. You have two kinds of dollies. I know, there's one that you put. What is that? These are dollies, bud. If you go over there, I'll show you. Okay, get your scotch bright and sandpaper. Back right by my chair there. That's your, see, that's your point, bud. What were, you, what were you asking about dollies? What did you say about the dollies? Can you talk a little louder? No, oh, I got them right here. You want to show them, bud? Yeah, there is. I don't understand. Get them over here and bring them over, over here so we can see. I don't understand. What Trevor says there's actually two kinds of dollies, so we're going to see what he says here. Hold on, maybe Trevor's actually learning something. All right, where are we going? What are you doing? But we got the radio on over here. You have to talk loud. But you, what do you mean there's two kinds of dollies? Dolly? What does it look like? You put stuff on it to roll it around? That's another dolly. That's a furniture dolly. That's what I said. That's another dolly. Oh, well, let's go look at the other dolly. Were you talking underneath the willies over there? Not that dolly, but the dolly is to take out the furniture. Oh, the two wheel dolly. Right here. That's another dolly. Oh, that's. Oh, that's another dolly. Yeah, you're pretty smart, bud. I thought you did another kind of dolly. Right, that's called a two-wheel dolly. That's a wheel dolly. See, look, come here. I'll show you the difference, bud. See what the difference is? This is called a hammer dolly. Put that in your hand and see. And see. See there? That's a hammer dolly, bud. But see how it's... It's not heavy. Yeah. It's just heavy. But you need a nice heavy dolly, hammer dolly. I know it's not heavy. You know what I mean? No, it just it just feels heavy. It's not yeah. heavy to me. But the reason you use a nice heavy hammer dolly is so you get a good, nice hard hit right in this area here. See? Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Can you see it? Okay. What's up? Now, see, that's a different. It's the same type of dolly, but it's different. See, it's shaped different. Do you see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. See the see it's shaped different, bud. Okay, thanks. Corners. Thank you very much, Trevor, for that lesson. Now we know the difference between a two-wheel dolly and a hammer dolly. Am I right? Yeah. That was a good uh, observation. It's going to be a hot butt today. Do you know what the difference is between a sanded horn and a non-sanded horn? Yeah. What? The horn's already done. That means Trevor needs to get the other one done. Yeah, I said that a non-sanded horn or the horn's not sanded. Thank you. Still got a long way to go, partner. It's gonna take you two more days, it looks like. No, I just don't want to talk. Okay, it. let's get it done, bud. You're doing a good job. Okay. All right, Trevor is actually learning something here. He knows the difference between a two-wheel dog. Trevor already knew that before he worked here. Is that right? I knew that. 
Oh. But you didn't uh, have a hammer dolly, did you? Okay, so he does know the difference. That's good. He's learning something here. See, that's what it's all about. It's about learning and using and working and getting the horn. So we're going to take our hammer dolly. And I got two different dollies. See, this one has a flat surface. So when I pound on the inside. Because on this particular job, it's very important that you have this edge perfectly straight by the way it fits down into the car, okay? The way it fits down in the car, this edge is real close, and if you don't get it right, what's gonna happen is it's gonna rub on the fenders and chip your paint off. And we definitely don't wanna do that with Arthur, do we? So, we take our dolly, we go all the way around, section out where you can see where it's rotted. I'll cut that section out. I'll make me a new section and weld it on there. Get it all fabricated. We're going to go ahead and paint the inside of this. We'll go ahead and paint the inside of that. We'll spot weld it all together and it should look brand new and ready for restoration 101. Does that make sense, Trevor? He wasn't listening. He's busy working. That's good. That's what we want. This is Pete. We'll see you later. Do you have anything to say about your horn restoration? Do you want to tell everybody out there the right and proper way to do it? Okay, you got to come over here because they can't hear you when you're whispering. Over here, say it. Come on over here. All right. Right here, right here. Look, look. You got to look up in the camera. As you think, say it's hard, but yeah. It's hard and what? Hold on, let me get that camera down there. Okay, hold on, bud. Say it one more time. You said you had two things to say. It's not, it's hard. It's your first time. I've never done this. Can you look at the camera when you say that? I've done it a long time, so. And you have to take your time and do it right. Is that all you had to say? Or are you just bullshitting with me so you can take a break? Okay, thank you, sir. There you go. You got to take your time or it's going to get messed up. Did you learn that on the Speed Channel? Oh, where'd you learn that? Oh, okay. All right, go ahead and sit down and let's get her done, bud. Oh, that's good. Thank you. Okay, we're trying to get it done. Trevor's trying to get it done. Part-timer's been a full-timer this week. As everybody knows, Charlie's not with us. Charlie is uh, incarcerated right now. Charlie is uh, on vacation, permanent vacation for a little while. Uh, He's in jail. Thank you. Huh? What the fuck? Where is he? Jail. Oh, permanent vacation. We'll see you later. This is Pete. I try to help people out, and you know, that's what happens. Wow. We'll see you later. Take it easy. We'll be back on our hood. We'll be back on our hood. Insert. We always are back. Take it easy.